Ever since I was born, I was destined to be the best cheerleader. My mom believed in me, my coach believed in me, and I tried my very hardest that I could. And one day, I was gonna be a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader. Come on, you can do it, just Eliana, and you are gonna be the world's best cheerleader. Happy birthday, little Eliana! Just remember, you are going to be the best, and I mean ever. So, that is your destiny, and you will not have any other course but that. Second grade. We should totally join the cheer team. Yes, I want to be a flyer. How can we both be flyers? There's only one flyer and it's gonna be me. No way, I'm definitely better than you. There's <gasps> no way you're making the team. My mom said I'm gonna be the best cheerleader in the world. And she said I can dye my hair blonde like a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. They get all the boys and they're really rich. <gasps> Wait, we should go practice. Okay. Five, six, seven, eight. We are smart, we are clean, we're gonna join the cheer team! Yay! Mommy, mommy, how did I do? Okay, did you see? I just took a video of it and I want to show you, but right now I'm so upset I can't even show you. I'm gonna tell you what you were not doing. You did not smile big enough, you were not sharp enough, and how, with that performance, are you gonna become a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader? Like, I don't even know how we're gonna do, that, do anything like that. And the hair? No, the hair's not gonna work. We need to go ahead and make it blonder. We need to go bleach it, so let's go next. Eighth grade. Me too. Okay, I wonder what cheer we're going to do. Okay. All right, you guys, this is eighth grade cheer. I hope you guys are ready. You guys aren't babies anymore. I better see better. I better see better moves, bigger cheers, bigger smiles, bigger everything. You guys aren't babies anymore. I'm so excited. Understood? Yes. Yes. So you guys are gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Good job. Let's do that again. If you guys want to be Dallas Cowboy cheerleaders, I'm going to need to see big improvements because what I'm seeing right now is horrible. I don't even know what you call it because it's certainly not cheer. So I'm going to need to see some improvement right now where you guys are out finding a brand new team and you guys will go back to wherever you came from. Wherever you came from, I don't care, but it won't be cheerleading. I've been a cheerleader since I was born. I got this. I can do this. I'm going to be the best in the world and I'm going to win. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two. Let's just do it one more time. I'm sure you girls got it this time. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One. What the heck, Ellie? How am I supposed to be a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader when there are people like you messing me up all the time? What was that? I know, she's so rude. This is not acceptable, okay? Dallas Cowboy cheerleaders do not bully and I never wanna hear a mean word out of your mouth ever again. Do you understand me? Fine. You're off the team. What? Yeah, you heard me. <laughs> hey, Ellie, can you please open up? Hi. Listen, I'm so sorry about what she said to you, okay? That was not okay at all, and don't worry, I definitely ripped her new one. But listen, I see a lot of potential in you. I think you were incredible, and I think you could definitely be one of the best. So I have a present for you, but don't, don't open it yet. I want you to open this when you become a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader, okay? But only once you are a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. Hold on to it. Please don't open it. Just trust me on this. You have so much potential. You're amazing. Thank you, Coach Mara. Of course, of course. 
high school cheerleading. Are you so excited for the first day? I'm so excited, but I kind of wish I was cheer captain. I mean, I think we all do, but like, you know, the one person who we didn't want to get cheer captain is cheer captain. Like, I don't even know why she was picked. Like, there's like no, like, she's not even good. I mean, it must have been rigged because I don't know how she got cheer captain. Yeah, she probably cheated her way into it or something. I mean, we're obviously- Who knows, she's crazy. Like, why, 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 why should we be learning after her? You know, maybe we should just leave. We could quit. Yeah, we can do that. I don't know if I can even stand to be around her. Mm -mm. Listen, listen, I got something. What if we like make up like a rumor or something and spread it around? The whole thing. Oh, it's oh, the funniest thing. Oh my god. Oh, hi. I, I think the girls are trying to sabotage you. What are you talking about? I, I heard them like saying something. I think they're gonna like text like the whole school or something. I don't know, but. They, I they have it, no reason to do that. Why are you lying? I don't think they like you as, as the leader of the, the cheer team. I don't know. You probably heard them talking about something else. Don't try to ruin my friendship with them, okay? I'm not trying to do anything. I'm just trying to let you I know. don't need this right now. I know okay, you're I'm lying. I'm trying to help you. You're I'm not, my why friends, would I lie okay? to you? They wouldn't do that. Year because we all need college cheerleading scholarships, okay? Uh, of course we do, so you know you gotta teach us well. So we I am, exactly, yeah. Okay, so like we can't cheat, right? Oh no, I mean, I mean are you familiar with cheating? Because like that would be good. Yeah, like oh, yeah. I don't like cheaters. Yeah, oh, yeah. Spread like a whole like rumor that Eliana's like I don't I don't know like cheating or something. We're gonna get in trouble though. I mean, but like, do we care? Because you know she was honestly the one that cheated. You know. That's true. Like if if we if we say it enough, we'll believe it. She wants to be a cheerleader for the Dallas Cowboys. Do you think that she'll actually be able to do that? No, if we, you know, make up this, this is rumor? totally gonna ruin it. Seriously, Eliana is a. And now college. What? What's wrong? I just, I can't anymore. College is so much harder than high school too. Like, I never expected it would be this much more difficult. Okay, Eliana, Eliana, stand up, stand up. Come on. Listen. Look, look, What's you got this. Hey, stop. Listen to me. You're one of the best cheerleaders I know, okay? You're gonna do good. You have but a once those girls in high school spread those rumors about me, like my whole life has been over. You don't understand. I know, but think about it. You have a scholarship. You're gonna be one of the best cheerleaders in the world, okay? You're gonna be like the Dallas Cowboys' best cheerleader. I don't even okay? know anymore. I don't deserve no, to be a Dallas do. Cowboys cheerleader. Eliana, you're amazing, okay? You're like the best cheerleader ever. And plus, Eliana. Stop, just no, stop. stop. I, I don't deserve I, any I, of this. One more thing. I've been waiting to do this. What? Will you marry me? Are you serious? Yes. Oh my god. Yes! Oh my god, I don't even know what to say! Thank you just, so just much! Just don't give up on your dreams, okay? Yeah, no, I'm very well aware, but... Okay, listen, can I call you back? I have practice in literally one minute, and um, Coach is going to be really mad at me if I'm late. So, can I call you back? Okay, cool, thanks. cheated on me. You know what? It's over. Why does this always happen? Adulthood. Ah, I love being an adult. Just 
so free from everything, no crazy cheer mothers, no pressure, no anything. I think I'm gonna give up being a cheerleader. I don't know. I just, I have no motivation for it anymore and just took up my whole entire life to where I don't even wanna. Random number. Hello? Yes, speaking. What? You're telling me Coach Miller is dead? No, 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 this can't be possible. What? Are you serious? cheerleader. We just need to figure out where the tryouts are. The tryouts might have been like six months ago. Don't really know, but you know what? That is okay. We will stop at nothing. We will get justice for Coach Miller and we will do what she told us to do because she was always there for us when I was getting picked on by those horrible boys. Oh God, I can't even think about it. She was the one person there for you and you will do this for her. We will stop at nothing. So this is my big moment. I have literally been dreaming of being a Dallas Cowboys cheerleader since I was born and I only have one shot. I need to just do whatever I can to make sure that I get on this team for justice for my Coach Miller, which I will always have a special place in my heart for, but I gotta do this. Coach Miller, this is for you. Sorry, but um, the tryouts are over. Uh, yeah, you, you don't understand. Wait, uh, come on, they just ended like five minutes ago. No. You don't, listen, we've already you don't like, understand turned in what everything. We've already turned in everything. Okay, We're just a like, a lot of the girls up. have been through a lot that are in there. You should show no. up on time. That's part of being a responsible cheerleader. Listen, you Absolutely. don't understand. The situation is black and white. So we're late. Yes. Wait, no, but I literally had to break up with my boyfriend because he cheated on me. I've been married five times. I'm sorry. Yeah, and you know what? Like, are you literally crying, sweetheart? Please, just no, no, listen no. to my story. Save your tears for the pillow. I'm gonna tell my story. I, when I was born, was destined to be a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. I literally came out of the womb in a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader outfit. In this outfit I'm wearing right now. I have been through so much. I have had rumors spread about me. My boyfriend cheated on me. My cheer coach, that one person that believed in me, my mom was horrible to me. I had bullies. I had the whole world turning against me. My cheer coach, he one person for me. Get this, he died a couple hours ago. And I have this box that I need to open that I can't open until I become a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. And I'm gonna need you to let me on the team because you guys don't understand. This is, nothing in the world is more important to me than being, a da no! than being a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. So I'm gonna need you to do whatever we can because I literally think I have no, nothing to do with life if I'm not a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader. Like, I can see you, Look. Like I think if we let her uh, audition, she'll shut up. Yeah, like after those kicks. <laughs> yeah, you wait, can, you wait, can go try. Wait, so I'm on the team? You have to. I'm on the team! No, 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 no. You have to audition. But can you just make this one exception? Look, I can, I can bend my leg. Okay, well, uh, that's that's kind of impressive. I mean, yeah. Look, I, 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 I can, look, I can do this that too. That's pretty good. She's, she's tan. She is, she's tan. I'm blonde. I mean, my mom bleached my hair since I was a little girl because all Dallas Cowboy cheerleaders, you know, they're supposed to be blonde. Oh, oh my. I think your mom might be a psycho. Oh yeah, I think definitely so. Wow. Yeah, we, we, I kind of feel sorry for her. She looks a little pathetic. Have your people call my people. We'll Does that mean I'm on the team? We'll think about it. <gasps> Thank you so much. I'm a Dallas Cowboy cheerleader? Oh my god, you think 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 you
not thank you enough for this. Trust me, you are not gonna regret this. This is gonna be the best decision you ever made. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. <laughs> I'm a Dallas Cowboy cheer! Finally, I've waited so long for this. Which means, finally, I can open this box that I have waited years to open. I feel like butterflies and magic are just gonna come out of this box when I open it. <laughs> open on your deathbed? What is that supposed to- that's it? Is there something else- that's it? I've waited literally my whole entire life just to open on my deathbed? Oh, that is not okay. I guess there's something really magical in here, you guys. Make sure you stay tuned. I guess I'll see you when I'm on my deathbed. Well, that was awkward. Now that I'm on my deathbed, I can finally open the letter. I wonder what it's gonna be. Oh! Oof. Oh no! Oh. This is a, my whole life is up to this moment. Oh! A cookie crumb. Huh? Back in my cheer days, I used to eat these. But our coach told him they were gonna make us fat. And I did maybe gain like five pounds from eating these. Now what I've been waiting for, the letter. I don't understand. Be you. That's it! That's all that's in the letter! Oh my god, they're giving me a heart attack! This is my whole life! Where are this moment and that's it!